I knew there was a fan in here. Look at the size of this thing. Luke, I am your father. All right, guys, we have made it all the way to Slidell, Louisiana, to go to this Spirit Halloween right back here. And it is so hot out here, I don't even know what I am doing in these southern states. Get me out of here. I'm sweating like a hog when it's not this hot. It's like 90 out here. What in the world? Isn't there just like an air conditioner I can wear around my neck or something? Anyways, all right, let's go on in to this Spirit Halloween right here, Slidell. Louisiana reminds me of Rydell High on the movie Grease. Hello, non-automatic doors. <laughs> All right, guys, here we are. I absolutely love the process of walking into a spirit Halloween store and seeing all the awesome Halloweeniness. Right off the bat, Lord Farquaad is going crazy. Look at how much his head is like bouncing. He's he's not only bouncing, he's bounding. He's bounding towards us to kill us with his beak. I do like how somewhere there's a fan or some blowing wind somewhere because look at how their clothes are blowing spooky-like in the wind. All right, let's say hello to Possessed Pumpkin. Hello to Rexy. You little monsters have been carving up my friends for years. Now it's my turn to make a I love how it looks when both of them are going at the same time. Oh my gosh, look at Grim, guys. Look at this. He has a state prison plaque on crime grave robbery. Grim, you crazy, crazy fellow. Are you gonna work? There we go. Ah, you look like death walked over my breast. This is good. That is too funny. So <laughs> look how it swings when he turns. This is a pretty busy store, guys. You know what? Let's look over here before we do anything else. I know I'll talk to you in a minute, Boggy, because I want to see if they have the bag clips that I've been looking for. If they have them, they are more than likely somewhere in this corn maze. All right, well, here's a bunch of them, but automatically I can tell you they do not have the ones that I'm looking for, unfortunately. Sometimes they're even on a top here, like you can see there's a pack of them over here, but again, it's not what I'm looking for. I knew there was a fan in here. Look at the size of this thing. Luke, I am your father. If you guys don't get that, I don't know what to tell you. All right, let's make our way back over here. We gotta go see the Boggy. I promised him we would come back and say hi. Hello, Boggy. <laughs> Okay, let's go ahead through the Tunnel of Death. Oh my gosh, okay, look at this, guys. We saw this in one other store where it's like a paper insert in here instead of the actual bubbles. And I was talking to one of the managers of the stores and they told me that whenever they're putting the water in, if it happens to leak, they are actually given these inserts to put in there so that it still appears that there are bubbles of death. Uh, they're not bubbling my face. However, I do think it looks cool to see this guy with his hair blowing in the wind. That is too funny. All right, Crouchy, give us what you got. That hair blowing in the wind is too creepy, man. Oh my gosh. And we got Barry over here. He's just got a little bit of hair, but it's not blowing in the wind. Wait, let's go back around and come out this way because, yep, there he is, the Tombstone of Terror. Is he going to scare us? Are you going to scare us, Toomey? Come on now, Toomey. He's hiding. I thought maybe he was going to trick us, but all right. Hello, Chains of Death. We've got Shorty here with his little bit of hair blowing in the wind. Look, even the skulls are blowing in the wind. Okay, before we forget, let's come on over and say hello to Monty. Hello, Monty. Come on, Monty, do your stuff. There he goes. Okay, good enough. All right, we got one lone animatronic here, guys. Mr. Punchy. 
Holy crap, look at the size of this fan. Duke, I am your <laughs> I can't help it, it's so cool. All right, let's check out Nazi here with the crazy, crazy hair. Both of his lights are working. Usually at this point with all of them that I've seen, there's like one light out or his eyes aren't working, but this guy is looking good. We got Skelly and Lucky Bottoms. Come on, Bottomless Joe. I love how his hair just like bounces around. All right, Skelly, give me what you got. Come on, come on now, Skelly, come on. Come on now, Skelly, come on now, Skelly. <laughs> I can't imagine what people are thinking if they hear me. Anyways, we got the bag of bones here. Come on, there we go. And look at this, guys. Holy crap. We have Mr. Dark straight out of the Spirit Halloween movie. Let's get him going. I hope he doesn't come alive and kill me and eat me. There he is. Okay, stay right there, sir. Please do not kill me. We got the jumping spider who is in suspended animation. And we have Betty Sharp. Let's see if she's working. Come on there, Betty. She's saying the same thing about stick your head in my bag. No, ma'am. No, thank you. Okay, let's go through the electrical tunnel of death. We're buzzing. These are working exactly how they should. And the electricity is ready to kill us. All we have to do is walk through. Hold on. Let's try it again. All we have to do is walk through. Ah! Hello, Reagan. I didn't forget you. I just don't like you very much. All right, let's check out the creepy dolls, guys, because I bought one in the last store I was at, and it was actually the vintage Wolfman doll. They have two of them here. They have a pumpkin nester hiding behind them. Rosalie, decrepit Donna, we have hugs. We have the cracked baby face doll and eerie Emma, and I think that's all. Yeah, that's all. Oh my gosh, look at this, guys. The only zombie babies they have are one, two, three, four, five of this guy. What do you think they're talking about right there? Did anybody adopt you yet? No, did anybody adopt you? No. Look at this, guys. There's one, two, three, four double heads here, but I don't see one hook head hog or hook eye guy. Excuse me, sirs, can you tell me where the hook eye guy is? Oh my gosh, guys, look how many vampire door knockers they have. I think there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, there's eight of them. Eight vampire door knockers, and there's five devil door knockers. We have two of the creeping cats. And as you know, we have two of the secret keeping cats. And two of the hello rats. We have an Annabelle. Plenty of ghost face bobbleheads, but only one leather face bobblehead and no Michael Myers bobbleheads. But we do have the Frankenstein sidesteppers, the Pennywise sidesteppers, the Billy Butcherson sidesteppers, the Sam sidestepper, and the Spiky sidestepper. Is there another one back there? No, I guess not. We have Sam greeters, we have killer clowns, inflatables and the Sam inflatable. I don't see the Crouchy plush, but we do have Skelly. There's two of them, actually. With those yellow eyes, it feels like he's actually looking at us. Hello, Bouncy Jack. Guys, I absolutely love that they have the Danny Dennison costume. I just wish that they had something for Max. Like, I don't know what it would be. All he does is wear, like, tennis shoes and jeans. Maybe if they had, like, a tie-dye shirt and a hat or something. I don't know. But the Danny Dennison costume is definitely awesome. Oh, look at this. Somebody was telling me about these plush toys online. It's a little plush stuffed axe. What the heck? What else do we have in here? We have a hammer, like a clown hammer. Okay. We have a sucker. So this could be like Sam's trick-or-treat sucker. Um, what else? Oh, look at this. We have a knife. It's like Chucky's knife. A stuffed plush Chucky knife. I think that's it. There's a baseball in here too, but um, okay. That's funny. Everything else has to do with murder except for the baseball. <laughs> Wait a minute. Did we even say hello to Punchy? Looking at him, I think that, yeah, they sort of have the back of his head puffed out. A lot of times he's just a half a head because they forget to puff it out. All right, let's get him going here because I don't think we even talked to him today. I'm a clown just spinning around. Come on, don't say bad no. words. Ooh. Who's going down? Okay, bad words, bad words! Like, why does he have to say bad words? They have the killer clown's hand puppets. I think these look awesome, but I mean, I honestly, like, don't have anything that I would do with them because 
well, to be honest with you, I've never even seen the movie, guys. When I get home after this tour, I am gonna sit down and have a movie night and watch Killer Clowns from Outer Space. And I'll bet you at that point, I will wish that I would have bought the hand puppets. Here's the snow globe, and I am still on the lookout for that Headless Horseman snow globe. I know that my son found it in A Spirit Halloween, but I have no idea where it would have been, and I have not seen one at all. This is absolutely insane. It could be one of those things that they put out like years ago or something, and just one of them found its way back to a store. I don't know, but I love the Headless Horseman. Okay, this one is pretty dang awesome itself. It's Binks from Hocus Pocus in front of a headstone. That is pretty cool. I like the black snow. I wonder, is it supposed to be making sounds? I think so. Does it light up? Oh, yeah. I can barely hear it because it's so loud in here, but that is awesome. Look at this towel, guys. It's Jack Skellington holding his head just like the figure in the blind bags that we found. That is totally awesome. Oh my gosh, guys, look at this. I don't think I've seen this in any other stores. Nightmare Before Christmas Mayor Kit. The mask is in there and everything. It's kind of strange that they have the mask and the costume, but there's like, they don't sell the mask alone. All right, let's see what comes with it. The half mask with attached hat. What? So the hat, okay, I see the hat is part of the mask. Comes with a ribbon pin and a spider pin. The rest of it you have to put together. So you have to find a blazer and a white shirt. That's not too bad. That is pretty dang cool. How much is that? $36.99. All right, guys, that is it for the Spirit Halloween in Slidell, Louisiana. Pretty cool store. Man, it was not cool in there, though, at all. It was super hot. But I did get to do the fun Darth Vader Star Wars voice in the fan. So, all right, I'm out of here, guys. Stay tuned. We have plenty more before the season is over.